Hello, welcome back to our series on matrix. Today we'll learn how to multiply matrices of 3 cross 3. In the previous video, we learned how to multiply matrices of order 2 cross 2. So these are square matrices. In the next series, we'll learn how to multiply, if it is possible, two non-square matrices. Today we'll learn an extension of the multiplication of two cross two matrix, which is a three cross three matrix. Like this, we can go on multiplying the product. The first element would be arrived at by multiplying row one with column one. Okay, this is a sum product of row 1, column 1. So the first element in the product would be equal to minus 1 into 12 plus 4 into 8 plus minus 6 into 3. Right. Similarly, the next element would be in the first row would be row 1 would arrived at by multiplying row 1 with column 2 elements some product of row 1 with column 1 elements so what would it be it will be minus 1 into 7 plus 4 into 0 plus minus 6 into 2 All right similarly the last element of the first row would be say C2 will be row 1 into C3 right which would be minus 1 multiplied by 6 plus 4 into 5 plus minus 6 into 4 so this completes the first row all right so now let's go and find out the second row of the product. Second row of the product will be arrived in the same way, but only this time instead of row 1, we will use row 2. So what would it be? Yes, it will be 8 into 12 plus 5 into 8, which is this into this plus 16 into 3. Now the next in the same row, this is row 2, this is row 1. In the row 2, the next element, column 2, row 2 would be the sum product of row 2 elements with column 2 elements. So what would be? It would be 8 into 7 plus 5 into 0 plus 16 into 2. Right? Similarly, for the last element of row 2 would be row 2 into column 3. That's a sum product. So sum product is 8 into 6 plus 5 into 5 plus 16 into 4 all right now for the last row row 3 row 3 would be same support same system some product of row 3 with column 1 column 2 and column 3 will give you the row 3 of the product so what that would be it would be 2 2 into 12 plus 8 into 8 plus 5 into 3 and now next element row 3 column 2 would be 2 into 7 plus 5 into 0 sorry it's 8 into 0 this is 5 8 into 0 plus 5 into all right so the last element would be row 3 column 3 which is 2 to 6 plus 5 into 8 plus 5 into 4 let's find out when we simplify what does it become when we simplify this whole thing becomes minus 12 plus 32 minus 18 
right minus 7 plus 0 minus 12 minus 6 plus 20 minus 24 this is 96 plus 40 plus 48 and this would be 56 plus 0 plus 32 and the last one would be 48 plus 25 plus 64 and now simplifying the last row 24 24 plus 64 plus 15 plus 14 plus 0 plus 10 12 plus 40 plus 20 by just summing up all this and putting them in a matrix uh, so the first one would be minus 40 plus 32 is minus 8 this is minus 19 and the last one would be minus 30 plus 20 is minus 10 all right so this would be 40 88 plus 96 so that's 184 and this is 88 and this would be 100 112 plus 25 112 plus 25 is 137 right and this would be the last row would be 24 plus 64 which is 88 plus 15 98 and 103 and this would be 14 plus 10 which is 24 and 60 plus 12 that is 72 so this is the product of the two matrices that we started off with right these two matrices the product of these two matrices is equal to this so this is how we multiply a two three cross three matrix together keep watching math smart subscribe to math smart to know when we upload a new video